Over the past few weeks, I've invested in a number of different Solana meme coins, and a lot of these have performed really well. We saw all the drama with Bonk, where it rallied to over a $1 billion market cap, and I thought I had to get in, so I want to talk about the one that's been performing the best, because I got into this project around a $25 million market cap. It's called Myro, symbol M-Y-R-O, and now it's over $200 million, but I think it has potential to go even higher than that. And if you guys haven't seen, I've talked about this project over on our Twitter already when it was a much lower market cap, but I think it's time we do a full deep dive on this project, really giving you um, all the details on it, because this project currently has around 43,000 followers on Twitter. It's been growing rapidly on social media and in terms of its price and market cap right now it's up 22 percent over the last 24 hours and sitting at a 221 million dollar market cap so when we got in a few weeks ago if you guys have been following me on any social media platform it was about 5x lower than where it is now. It was around five cents per token. So it's currently sitting around 24 cents per token, so just under a 5X. But I think this project has even more potential to go higher because Solana meme coins have been exploding. Right now, Solana meme coins are valued just around 1.3 billion dollars and Myro is one of the largest. It is the third largest Solana meme coin in terms of market cap. Bonk is number one, Dog with Hat is number two, and Myro is number three. There's a few others that I've talked about in other videos before, and I'll do a video diving deeper into some of these, but I think Myro has potential to be the next Bonk and even surpass it in terms of market cap because of a few things with its uh, behind its story. So Myro is is, uh, it says Myro the dog named after Solana co-founder Raj Gogol's dog Myro. This is something that's really important because the Solana community is extremely strong and seeing that there is a project that has launched based off the Solana founder's dog's name, I think that's why this project has gained so much attention because not only does it have a good story behind it with the idea of launching it uh, connected to the Solana founder's dog's name, but also because of the fact that this project has really good graphics, really good website, and a really strong community. If you're looking at the graphics and the website, it's way better than any other meme coin I usually see. Most meme coins, their websites don't really put so much detail into their designs. They are more so about community, and there's nothing wrong with that, but this one is all about community and also about design. You could see that with this project, it's already gained a lot of attention. It's on Coinex, BitGet, XT.com, uh, XT MEXC, Polynex, BingX, uh, so many others like MEXC and BitMart. This just list goes on and on. So with this project, the reason why I did invest in it, and I have about like 40,000 tokens. So it's sitting close to like nine, ten thousand dollars $10,000. But the reason why I have this many tokens and why I'm continuing to hold them, I'm not planning on selling them anytime soon, is because of their story behind it and the community coupled with the current market conditions. So like I said, Myro, a little bit about them. It's the name of the dog owned by Raj Gokul, one of the founders of Solana. The project pays homage to the dog. The way to buy the token is very simple. I bought it personally on Phantom. I just have like a Phantom wallet right here, uh, like connected on my um, desktop. So it's just like a Google Chrome extension. If you guys haven't used Phantom before, super easy to go about downloading it. It's just a Solana wallet. But you could also go ahead and get it on a number of different exchanges um, where it's listed. You could see if you go to its price, you click on markets. It's listed on BitGet, uh, BitGet. KuCoin, Bybit, MEXC, BitMart, like basically everywhere this project is. So it's not like you're going to have any trouble finding it, but I personally did buy some on um, Phantom Wallet. So I just like keeping my tokens in my Phantom Wallet or like in my MetaMask Wallet, depending on which uh, network I'm using. So if it's like Ethereum or BNB or Solana, that's what I do. They also show that you could buy it uh, using Mayan or using Jupiter. But again, I just bought it directly on the Phantom Wallet. Some of the features are the Myro buy bot. So Solana's first buy bot on Telegram, it's promoting cross pollination and offering free exposure through the Myro trending. As adoption grows, a small fee for trending will be introduced. Um, with a chance for free inclusion, uh, generate revenue feeds into Treat Jar Treasury for transparency. You can click and add the bot right here. 
They also have the Miro staking. You can unlock the full potential of Miro investments with staking pool utility. That's going to be coming soon. So you can earn additional rewards as well. There's going to be some more utilities as well, long term with the project. So you can see really right now, it's just this Miro buy bot. You could click on add buy bot and it's a Solana buy bot um, that you would click, send a message to, and it's just directly on Telegram. It has all the details right here. When you scroll down a little bit further, you can see some of the details where it talks about tokenomics. One thing I do like about that is the tax, 0% buy tax, 0% sale tax. That's something that you like to see because a lot of meme coins have extremely high taxes. Makes it a bit more expensive if you want to trade or get involved or if you do sell, it makes it a bit more expensive. So not with um, Myro. Last few things with Myro are going to be with its actual community. So like I said, the community with Myro is really strong. We've seen it already grow to over a $200 million mark cap. It is the third largest on the Solana blockchain. But more importantly, as you can see that their social media presence has been growing very rapidly and they get a ton of engagement all the time. They currently have around 43,000 followers and they are followed by some of the biggest names in the crypto space from Cousin Crypto to Altcoin Gems to Fabric Crypto and a few others. Those are just some that I follow over on Twitter. And you can see that they also follow Myro. Myro also is live on a number of other cool and interesting platforms. You can see they recently talked about it on Travala. It's live on Travala, and you can enter to win $900 to use towards 3 million different travel products. You can see all the details right here. You could go ahead, check that out because that's on the Google Play Store and the App Store. But they have all these major partnerships with um, exchanges and... Uh, different applications. And this is just what helps the project grow long term. So this project right now is sitting at around 24 cents per token. I think it could reach that $1 billion market cap, which is really simple. It just put it right at a dollar per token. So this project, I think it could reach a dollar per token and it could surpass um, Bonk as the largest Solana based meme token in terms of market cap. So we need to keep an eye on this project, but this is one that I own. I've owned for a while now. It's done about a five X from when I bought it and I'm not planning on selling it anytime soon, but a lot of you guys have been asking about Solana meme coins, which ones I'm most bullish on. And this is definitely the one that I'm the most bullish on right now. That isn't a micro cap Solana project. So I have a few investments in micro cap Solana meme coins, but this is the most substantial one I have in terms of its market cap. And this is probably the safest one I have at this point in terms of market cap as well, because it is already a bit larger. It's not going to do hundred X from where it currently is, but I think it's very likely this project could do three, four, even five X from where it currently is.